it. I got creative market. We got some really cool affiliates. So if there's anything creative that you like to purchase or coffee or tea related that you like purchasing, please feel free to check out the affiliate links. They end up helping us out in the end. And all of that right now, I might be able to get a payout before the wedding based on stuff that I've already seen in my account, my backlog. And all of that would go towards wedding stuff. So I appreciate you. <laughs> How did you get those, if I may ask? Um, some of them is luck with the draw. And then some of it is that you kind of have to know where to apply for affiliates. Um, there's like three or four different sites that have like mass marketing ones. And then there's sometimes there's brands that can approach you for affiliate. So it really kind of depends. Um, I'll send you, I'll send you some info because Lexor, it's complicated to try to figure all of it out. My biggest recommendation would be make sure you have a PayPal, a separate PayPal account for all of it. Like for all of your stream and business stuff. Cause then that way you can track it easier. Um, but if you've got that, I'll send you info. Cause it's, sometimes it's tough to get all of these things, but sometimes you can just knock it out of the park real easily. I got my first furls from a giveaway. It's one of the resin ones and I don't like the feel. I want an Odyssey so bad, but the colors are already sold out. Puffles, you said you don't like the feel of the, of the resin ones. Is it too heavy? Is it too light? Tell me about it. Because for me personally, the resin ones are the right weight. But if it's too heavy, you gotta go down to the streamline, the wood. If you want the Odyssey, those are even heavier than the resin. I have, I have an Odyssey hook and I barely ever use it because it gives such wrist fatigue. Like the wrist and hand fatigue from the weight for me personally is a lot, but I, I, I used to lighter weight hooks. Give me clovers or give me death. I've wanted a set of clovers for a while and I just haven't done it yet. I haven't jumped the gun. What size is your Odyssey? Um, I believe, oh, pretty sure I bought my Odyssey in an eye hook. Cause that's what I end up using the most anyway. So I bought it in a size that I knew I would use it like most commonly. So I could try to get a lot of mileage at it since it was so expensive. They made G hooks and let me see if I can pull my Odyssey hook out. If it was a G I'd offer to trade. <laughs> I wish. Cause I would have taken you up on it too in like a fucking heartbeat. Pellmel, how are you, babe? I saw you sneak in and I'm sorry I didn't say hi to you. How are you, sweetheart? Clovers are love. Okay, I'll have to get a set of clovers. Where does everybody recommend that I buy my clover hooks through? Though the nitpick set is solid. Hey, guess what? I'm an affiliate with nitpicks too. <laughs> I'm gonna fill it with nitpicks too. I, I kind of made sure I hit all of the bases for all of you because I knew a lot of you were like knitters and crocheters and I know, I knocked it out of the park. <laughs> you get yours at Joann's? Okay, I'll have to look at there. Nitpicks hooks are sharp AF for no reason. Ooh, really? That's weird. Literally everything I buy is gonna feed back to you. Gothic hippie, I love you. There's a whole entire Discord channel, so you can never lose the links. Amazon and Michaels, I'll have to take a look at that cat. It's all right, I just got two new hobbies. Knitting and one of a kind doll making. Ooh. I want pictures. Hell no, I want pictures, babe. Joanne's, okay, I'll have to look. Yours aren't sharp? Okay, interesting. The ones on Amazon though, there's a ton of fakes. See, and that's what I've been worried about with Amazon. I'm like, I know there's a lot of fake stuff out there. Look for coupons and sale. I love coupons. We love a good coupon, honey. If you don't have the honey browser extension, what the fuck are you doing? Let's be honest. If you love coupons and you don't have the honey browser extension, what the fuck? You need that in your life faster than you realize. Oh, it's so helpful. And 
Here's the other one that you need. And a lot of people don't realize it. I'm not gonna log into my investment account. But, if you get an investment account with Acorns, I don't, I'm not gonna share my affiliate link with this one because, because you know, whenever you join these things, they're like, share this and every so-and-so number of people, you get extra, th I'm not gonna do that. That's bullshit, right? Because I don't want to sound like I'm forcing you to join. But this is what I've been doing. Um, I haven't set to, this is like an investment account. And basically there's a couple of things that this investment account can do. Um, like it's just a normal investment account, but you hook it up to like your debit card. And so you can turn on roundups. So for like, let's say every $5 you spend in like, so if like you spent something that was like $4 and 55 cents, Acorns keeps track of it and says, okay, well the roundup cost is 45 cents to get to the next whole dollar. When we hit a, hit a certain threshold of roundups, we're gonna take that and put that into your investment account. And then every week I automatically deposit $5 into this account. And then I also, there's a browser extension. So if you purchase using your, your linked card on certain sites, you can get additional investment. So let's say on like some sites, I could go on and do a first time purchase with something and they'll give me up to like 20%. Or even if it's my normal everyday purchases, like some of my lounge fly bags, I could go on there and sometimes they'll give me an extra two or three percent. Every penny counts. Rakuten is solid. Yes, Rakuten is how sometimes I've gotten a couple of those as well for my um, affiliates. I don't have pe pictures yet since I haven't done anything, but I have two new project ideas. Oh, Pell, Bell, please. Investing, the thing I'm most afraid of. I'm afraid of it too. I'm fucking terrified of it. But this has made it easier. Like, just as like a side account, aside from like my 401k that I already have, this has made it easier. And if you're curious about it and you would like my affiliate or like my, my friend join link, I'll send it to you, but I'm not gonna pimp it out with that code. Cause like, I don't want that to, I don't want you to feel like you have to do it in order to get me more money. Cause that would be really weird and shady. But if you have questions about it, let me know. And I can, I can show you some basic information on it. Like at least for my account, I'll, I'll show it to you privately, but not publicly. Absolutely not. You're betting at spending, you're better at spending anyway. <laughs> yeah, I love you. Shopkick is a good and pretty easy way to earn gift cards. Honey is as well. Yeah, see, and that's the one, like, Shopkick's the one, like, scanning barcodes of items that you purchase and earning points. Yeah, like, that's the stuff I want to do. Puffles, you finished a cute a project, this the cutest project this week. It was made with your newest 5mm clover. I want to see. I want to see. We're gonna do one more color tonight and then we're gonna call it. So let me see what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this color of blue right here. This is DMC 336. And what this color is, it's to fill in some more of these dark blue details all around in the cup. I may be what they call spoiled cat. Not at all. Oh my God, Puffles! Puffles, look how cute! Look how cute, that's adorable, look at the turtle. Oh, I love it. I wanna cuddle it, that's adorable. What kind of yarn are you using? 